welcome to another episode today we will be seeing the uh, answer to question does detachment mean running away from responsibilities does detachment mean running away from responsibilities we think detachment is the opposite of attachment attachment one puts all energy attention everything into a person or a thing if you think if you forcefully remove that then that is detachment forcefully removing ourselves putting our all our energy trying to move away from that that is what we call detachment but it is the same force in opposite direction actually it is not opposite direction it is in the same direction because you will get attached to something else and you are spending the same energy same conflict so inwardly though it is in the opposite direction inwardly you remain same spending your energy time attention and peace is gone in the same way so why do we get attached because we are empty in our cells we want to fill it up with something so we get attached if you understand the things in which we are attached say if it is drinking alcohol if you really understand it is harmful then the attachment falls away you don't want to harm your body or mind so the attachment goes away so that is non attachment once you understand the fallacy of getting attached to a person or a thing then the attachment falls away that is the way that is how it should be so let us see from so in that case you don't have to run away from your responsibilities you are leading your life but you are understanding the fallacies of attachment then you don't run away from your life but you understand what is attachment why you are attached so let us see first from j krishna mukti from his talks in ojai california in 1949 he asks why to find out why we are attached to a thing we are attached to a thing because inwardly we are empty we want to fill it up with something else we think it will give meaning to our life so that is why we are attached to a person or a thing and when we feel that it is not paying dividends it is not giving the pleasure but it is pain then we want to push it away we call it detachment so even the religion preach you should be detached to find the reality or truth but find out why you are attached and what will happen if you are not at- attached to your furniture to your car your ideas your beliefs beliefs and the persons and if you are not attached to your comfort to your family or anything else find out what you are holding on to disintegrate it dies everything goes away so the emptiness makes us search for something else the god the country or an organization or a master the guru and uh, ultimately everything will disintegrate everything any pleasure will cause pain so once we get detached from something then we get attached to something else because if you are doing with force then it leads to some other attachment so 
let us find out the reason the reason is we don't want to be a non entity find out don't fill your emptiness with things material things or persons find out what is in your perception who is the one who is possessing and don't try to cultivate the opposite detachment again it is merely a another cultivation another addition like attachment detachment is another addition whereas realizing the fallacy of attachment leads to non attachment so self gratification is one important factor which leads to attachment so such relationship born out of your necessity to fill up your emptiness will lead to conflict and pain so that is what jay krishna murthy says jay krishna murthy says it is in your inward emptiness that makes you to get attached to things and material and person so if you understand that and understand that attachment only brings disintegrates over a period of time and it brings a pain along with the pleasure if you understand that then it falls out that is non attachment then we will see a few lines from osho from the song of ecstasy if there is a too strong attachment with money or person then it is easy to run away from the world to do the opposite to think now i am unattached so you leave out your responsibilities and run away so attachment creates detachment the opposite and there is hardly any difference between the two that's what osho says and uh, what real truth is not to preach detachment but to find out the uselessness of attachment if attachment becomes meaningless if you understand that then that is enough you need not run away from anybody disappearance of attachment is detachment nothing else is needed no need to run away so people try to do so many things so many practices like standing on one's head finally osho finds out that just to find out that people go through a lot of exercises mental or physical to get detached forcefully remove oneself away osho calls the same as attachment that is the fact so he explains this through a story mulana sudin story he was suffering from a mental illness mulana sudin due to numerous phone call phone calls he received he became allergic to that whenever there was a phone call he became afraid even to lift the phone he was afraid what kind of news or trouble bad news or trouble it will bring so he was afraid to lift the phone but he has to use the phone no one can avoid it so he went to a psychiatrist psychiatrist over a period of time gave him some treatments and uh, one one day the psychiatrist was passing by mulla nasruddin's house he wanted to check up with mulla nasruddin he came in right the whole yardin how are you now after the treatment are you able to attend the phone calls mulla nasruddin said the treatment is good it is too good i have exceeded the expectation 
and uh, I guess it was surprise. What is that? It is too good. It has to be just good. You are supposed to attend the phone calls and you should be attending it. That's all. Now what is this exceeding expectations? No. Now I am able to attend all the phone calls. Not only that, even when phone is not ringing, I lift the phone and begin to talk. That is how we are. It's a funny, but that is a fact how we are. We forcefully do something, detach ourselves. We do the opposite. Another extreme. So attachment brings another extreme detachment, which is the same. Just the same negative consequences. You run away from your responsibilities, merely getting attached to new practices, the so-called religious practices, shutting away from everything, from the world, creating same pain for your body and mind. So that is not detachment. Attachment is non-attachment. Find out the fallacy of your attachment. Don't be like a lanasri exceeding the expectation. So with this, we will recap that detachment is not running away from your responsibilities. It is non-attachment. Once you find the fallacy of attachment, it falls away. You are not attached. There is no need for forcefully removing the attachment. So with this we will end this episode. Stay with me for another episode. Subscribe to my channel and share this with you. Thank you.